I mean, the work that Drive Syndrome UK does is, I think, amazing. I mean, obviously, I'm the chair of the charity, but I really think it's a very special charity. We have a multitude of things we do, and there's lots going on behind the scenes. Um, we run grants for adults that no other charity I know of really do. Um, we fund research into very specific things that mean quite a lot, hopefully, in the long term and, and the benefit families in the long term. Um, we have a great advisory board. We have the centre parts weekend. We have a very busy forum. We're all, we've welcomed a lot of new people over the last year. It's a very exciting time for Drave syndrome. There's a number of um, clinical trials going on for new medications, which is always, always good for our families. And we are hopeful that some of those will help our families and give them a better quality of life. There's lots of research into genetics. Genetics has moved on so quickly in the last few years. And, and I think that's an exciting opportunity for us to find, get some answers to why Drave syndrome is Drave syndrome. So in 2018, it is our 10-year anniversary of the charity, and it's a very exciting year for us. Um, we're planning to celebrate in many ways. We're doing fundraisers. We have a bike ride. Um, we are hosting our first corporate fundraiser, and we are looking at trying to define the diagnosis criteria for Drave syndrome. That's something that we've, we've wanted to work on for a while as a charity, and just bring some clarity to new families and also educate professionals, just to make sure that they are di diagnosing correctly.